All right. Well, when it comes to the national lockdown scene, some restaurants and businesses, they're just not waiting for their governments to lift the stay-at-home orders. And some have decided, you know, we're just going to reopen our businesses despite what any of you say. I got a full breakdown coming for you guys first really quick. Do me a big favor if you can and give this video a like. Let's try to get the likes way up here on this video if we can. Share the video here across all of your platforms. Help me to beat the YouTube algorithms, guys, who bury my videos. Never get them out there to anybody. You guys sharing these really helps to spread these out there. It's really because of you, so thank you so much. Subscribe if you're brand new, and if you guys enjoy my daily video content, you're gonna love my bonus content over on Patreon. Get over there, guys. What are you waiting for? Sign up, patreon.com slash conservative truth. Check the pretty link. It's right down there in the description. It takes you there. You guys can sign up and get all that bonus content where I talk more about sensitive information I can't bring it over here on YouTube, guys, for just as low as $5 a month. You can do more if you'd like as well, but $5 a month is going to get you access to all of that, and it really helps out my ministry. It helps support me here because YouTube, they're demonetizing my videos left and right, guys. I mean, they're not getting you the alerts for when I post the content. It's terrible what they're doing to me. I mean, look at me. I'm just a blind fat guy here for crying out loud. I'm just trying to bring you guys the news and events of what's taking place here in the last day. So thank you so much for everybody who's already a patron. And for those of you who are thinking about signing up and supporting, it really goes a long way. So thank you so much for all of that. Let's talk here about Texas, Harris County, Houston, Texas, the Federal American Grill. The restaurant owner said, you know what? I've been complying up to this point, but enough is enough. I'm tired of the government saying who can have their business open and who can't. He just gone ahead and reopened his business. He goes, I'm tired of doing the carry out and the, uh, you know, in the delivery thing. I've been doing that now for over a month. He has reopened his restaurant. Now, some restrictions that he's put in place for, you know, for himself, only opening at 30% capacity. So, uh, you know, probably taking some reservations, letting people come in, you know, again, only filling 30%, going to space people out, of course, everything like that. But he said, I have to start getting things going again. I'm not just going to sit idly by while I lose money, while my employee, you know, my employers lose money. It's just not going to happen. Now, here's the thing. Houston law enforcement, they are not enforcing this. They are not going out there to cite him or anything like that. In fact, they've said that they are not responsible for, you know, for enforcing the stay-at-home order, at least right here in Harris County. That's not taking place. So as of right now, the Federal American Grill, they're back up and running again. Again, limited capacity, but for dine-in, they are in fact open going against the Harris County order. So very interesting here that, you know, the Houston law enforcement, they're just going to let this happen. I can't say the same for Dallas though, guys, because in Dallas, Texas, well, one hair salon owner tried to open up their salon and got cited and got fined and everything like that for what they were calling, law enforcement was calling an illegal opening of a business. I mean, you ever think you'd hear that term, an illegal opening? It's a hair care. It's a hair salon for crying out loud. So it, it's crazy to see how some areas uh, are just, you know, go ahead and reopening and they're not worried about the consequences, some law enforcement not enforcing it. In other cities, they are enforcing it. Now, more and more states we know as of right now are moving to go ahead and reopen. In fact, in Georgia, that's really going on right now where Governor Brian Kemp is getting all kinds of backlash for even thinking to consider doing such a horrible thing as wanting to get his economy going back up again. And even the president criticized him for that and said that it's too soon. Everybody's talking out of both sides of their mouth, guys. They want the economy open, but then they don't want it open. We, we're losing control. We're losing control of our, of our country. We need to take it back. We need to take it back before it's taken from us for good. I'll put more information on this down below here in the description of this video. I want to hear from you. What do you guys think about this restaurant here in Houston? reopening despite you know the the takeout and delivery only order whatever do you support him opening for dine-in at least as a limited uh for a limited capacity let me know i'll be back with more you guys take care please be safe out there god bless each and every single one of you and i'll talk with you soon